slow things down, see what's happening in the 608 this morning. So this weekend marks the return of one of the biggest events this summer for local farmers. And Josh Brider is in Cambridge this morning with a preview of the Dane County Breakfast on the Farm. Hey, Josh. Hey guys, good morning. Yeah, a lot of excitement ahead of tomorrow with the Dane County Breakfast on the Farm. Returning after a couple of years, we're on the Hinchley Family Farm here in Cambridge this morning. Kristen Olson, the breakfast coordinator with us, and you guys are super excited because it's been so long before anybody could get together here in the farming community. Yes, it's been two years in the making. We are so excited to finally be able to celebrate our dairy farm families in Dane County again. So tomorrow morning out here at the Hinchley Family Farm, what do people need to know? Well, we're just really excited to welcome the, the community have them come to the Hinchley Farm, see where their food comes from, but also celebrate along the way. We'll have family-friendly activities all morning long, live music, the fabulous farm babe Pam Yonke will be here greeting breakfast guests, and a scavenger hunt for kids, and of course a farm fresh breakfast, the highlight of the morning. So we can't hold off anymore. What do you have in your hand right now? So no dairy breakfast is complete without ice cream, and our friends at Sassy Cow Ice Cream are providing the goods for us tomorrow morning. We'll have vanilla as well as salty cow ice cream. Uh, so we have salty cows here at the Hinchley Farm, so what better way to pay tribute to them? So I think we should taste test. I think we're going to hand the mic over to you, and I know Tina had mentioned earlier that there are a few salty cows out here at the Hinchley Family Farm, right, Tina? So we're going to try out the vanilla here this morning, guys. Mmm. So good. Mm -hmm. I mean, ice cream for breakfast, you can't beat that, right? right? Exactly. So, you know, if people are interested in coming out tomorrow morning, you guys are going to have some COVID protocols in place to make sure everyone stays safe as well. We will. Of course, with the recent mask mandate put in place by Public Health Madison in Dane County, we will be enforcing that in enclosed areas. But we'll have a lot of dining options outside in open airy spaces and a lot, if not all, of our activities are outdoors too. So come on, bring the family out, enjoy it. We'll be making about 15,000 pancakes, about 12,000 eggs go into our breakfast as well. So plenty for everyone. Yeah, and I think it's just cool to be able to see everyone back together because the local farming community, I mean, these are the people that are providing food for us as well. It's so important. Right, the dairy community contributes the biggest economic impact to our agriculture agriculture industry with nearly $40,000 billion. So it's a huge revenue for our economy and what better way to celebrate it than right here at Hinchley's Farm. I couldn't agree more, Chris, and thank you so much. Of course, we're going to get this up on channel3000.com. You're going to take the mic again because I got to keep digging in, guys. We're going to have some more commentary. We'll send it back to you guys as I dig in for my ice cream breakfast. Oh. <laughs> what kind of ice cream is he eating? What's the flavor? Salted caramel. Is that what I heard? Salted caramel. Oh, he doesn't. And there oh, we go. So Let's Get a good, uh, the vanilla good flavor. Up look. Yeah, can we get a close up of that label real quick? There we go. There it is. Oh yeah. Woo. Oh yeah. Rub it in. Jealous. Thanks, Thanks. Josh.